Um, what I've discovered about myself is there's some books that on audio allow me to first listen to where we're going and then when I pick up that same book, it brings to life things that I otherwise would have missed, probably just because it's my learning style. And um, But there is nothing like you and a book by yourself because it allows you to, I think, just let the walls down and allow yourself to be more vulnerable and more open um, to creating change depending upon, of course, the Oh, there's nothing book. like reading a physical book because it makes you stop what you're doing mm -hmm. and work on focusing and concentrating for a period yeah, of time. Totally. And you don't hear it in someone else's voice or uh, it, it, you hear it only through your voice and your mind speaking yeah. to you. So, so it, you de there's definitely a different learning style. Not that there's not a time and a place for, for audiobooks. I just think it, that you get something different from each way of consuming the content. Absolutely. Yeah. Do. And I think audiobooks um, are very, they could be very passive because you, you're doing other things like you kind of talked about and so you can be easily distracted and miss things that otherwise when you, it's just you looking at pages, um, you kind of realize when you've reread the same sentence five times and you're not getting anything so you have to stop your mind and stop letting it wander and then discipline it and get it back on point. Yeah. Which audiobooks you don't typically do.